Donald Trump muscled past his rivals to capture the first 2024 Republican presidential contest in Iowa on January 15, according to Edison Research Projections, once more asserting his dominance over the party as he seeks a third consecutive nomination. Florida Governor Ron DeSantis and former UN Ambassador Nikki Haley were in a battle for second place, Edison projected. With Trump's victory, all but a foregone conclusion, given his lead in public polls. The runner-up competition was expected to produce most of the evening's intrigue, as Mr. DeSantis and Ms. Haley seek to emerge as the chief alternative to the former president. The Hawkeye State endured its coldest ever Caucasus. With wind chills of minus 40 degrees Celsius forcing candidates to cancel events at the last minute and aids to fret over turnout. In the end, the networks were able to call the statewide contest barely 30 minutes after the caucus doors opened. A commanding victory for Trump in Iowa would bolster his argument that he is the only Republican candidate capable of taking on Democratic President Joe Biden, despite the four criminal cases Trump faces that could potentially turn him into a convicted felon before the November 5 general election. I'm hoping that it's a landslide, and I wouldn't be surprised, said 65-year-old Kim Pitts, a retired Christian bookstore owner and Trump supporter. Both Mr. DeSantis and Ms. Haley were aiming for a strong second-place finish that could demonstrate they might prevent Trump's inexorable march towards the nomination. Mr. DeSantis in particular had wagered his campaign on Iowa, barnstorming all of its 99 counties, and a third-place finish could increase pressure to end his bid. Polls show him far behind Trump and Miss Haley in the more moderate northeastern state of New Hampshire, where Republicans will choose their nominee eight days from now. Unlike a regular election, Iowa's caucus requires voters to gather in person in small groups, where they cast secret ballots after speeches from campaign representatives.